Hello, out of x power of 7 plus x power of 5 plus x power of 3 over x power of 6 plus x power of 5 plus x power of 4 is equal to 3. To find the value of x from this equation. So, from here x power of 3 is the lowest power. Then we take x power of 3 out of bracket. x power of 7 divided by x power of 3 is x power of 4 plus x power of 5 divided by x power of 3 is x power of 2 plus x power of 3 divided by x power of 3 is 1 bracket then over in here in the denominator we'll also take x power of 3 out of bracket then x power of 6 divided by x power of 3 is x power of 3 plus x power of 5 divided by x power of 3 is x power of 2 plus x power of 4 divided by x power of 3 is x bracket then is equal to 3. Then in next step, we'll simplify. x power of 3 will cancel this x power of 3. So it will be this over this. Then we'll divide by x power of 2 in the numerator and in the denominator. So it will be x power of 4 over x power of 2 then plus this x power of 2 over x power of 2 then plus this 1 over x power of 2 then over also in here we'll divide by x power of 2 so it will be x power of 3 over x power of 2 plus x power of 2 over x power of 2 plus x over x power of 2 then is equal to 3 then in next step, we'll simplify x power of 4 divided by x power of 2 is x power of 2 plus x power of 2 over x power of 2 is 1 plus 1 over x power of 2. Then over x power of 3 over x power of 2 is x. Then plus x power of 2 over x power of 2 is 1 plus x over x square. We'll simplify x will cancel by 1 and this square will cancel so it will be 1 over x then is equal to 3 then from the numerator and in the denominator we will let t is equal to x plus 1 over x because it is common now from here the numerator x square plus 1 will add 1 it will be 2 then plus this 1 over x square bracket because we add 1 so in here we'll minus 1 then over in here in the denominator it will be x plus 1 over x then bracket then plus 1 is equal to 3 then from here in the bracket, x square plus 2 plus 1 over x square is same as x plus 1 over x, then bracket square, then minus 1. Over, in here the denominator is x, then plus 1 over x bracket, then plus 1 is equal to 3. Then, in next step, from this equation, we will let x plus 1 over x as t. So, our equation will be t square minus 1, then over, in here it will be t plus 1 is equal to 3. So, from the numerator, in here, we'll make in form of a perfect square by applying the rule a square minus b square is equal to a plus b bracket bracket a minus b bracket. So this one is same as 1 square. Then to be a plus b is t plus 1 bracket then bracket a minus b is t minus 1 bracket over here in the denominator is t plus 1 is equal to 3. Then in next step, we'll simplify this t plus 1 will cancel. 
So it will be this t minus 1 is equal to 3. Then we take negative 1 to the right side, it will be t is equal to 4. Now from this value of t, in before we let t is equal to, we recall, t is equal to x plus 1 over x. So from t is equal to x plus 1 over x. Then we'll compare these two equations. So it will be this x plus 1 over x is equal to 4. Then to remove the fraction, we we'll multiply by x in both sides. So x times x is x square plus x times 1 over x. x will cancel this so it will be 1 is equal to this times this is 4x. Then we take 4x to the left side so it will be x square minus 4x plus 1 is equal to 0. Now to solve this quadratic equation, by quadratic formula x is equal to negative b plus or minus square root of b square minus 4ac over 2a. Then it will be x is equal to negative b is negative 4. Then plus or minus square root of b square it will be negative 4 square is 16 minus 4 times a, a is 1, then times c, c is 1, then over 2 times a, a is 1, then it will be x is equal to negative, and negative it will be positive 4 plus or minus square root of 16, negative 4 times 1 times 1 is negative 4. So 16 minus 4 is 12. Then over 2 times 1 is 2. Then in next step, it will be x is equal to from 4 plus or minus square root of 2 over 2. So from 4 plus or minus square root of 12 over 2. Then it will be x is equal to 4 then plus or minus square root of 12 is same as square root of 4 times square root of 3. Then over 2. Then it will be x is equal to 4 divided by 2 is 2 plus or minus square root of 4 is 2. 2 divided by 2 is 1. 1 times square root of 3 is square root of 3. So this is the value of x in this our problem. Whereas we have two answers because of plus or minus. Thank you for watching. Don't forget these steps to miss out. Subscribe to my channel and see you in the next video. Bye bye.